look it's new glasses day i love them um i don't normally wear glasses when i'm recording but these are my new barn not very teachery glasses so um i need to do so i thought i'd wear them anyway um i want you to think about how you're feeling this time last year when you were in year 11 how did you feel now because Oh, the year 11 staff feeling a bit stressed. It's all, it all starts to become quite real when we go back after February half term. Um, and I want you to think about that feeling. I want you to think about how it felt, how it got kind of like worse over time, how you felt when you got to exam periods and what you wish you could change about last year. Because you kind of have the opportunity to to do that, to change that. Because you've had year 11, you're in year 12, and we've got year 13 coming up. And what we don't want to happen is that feeling you had this time in year 11 being replicated next time in year 13. So if you're one of those people that said, I wish I'd started rising earlier, well, y you can. You, you, you get the very rare opportunity to see something that you've done wrong and basically it's kind of kind of like time traveling because you get to repeat your year 11 in year 13 you get to start revising earlier for your exams um whether it was kind of like you want to change how you're revising whether you want to start revising earlier you can do that think about year 11 a uh, year 13 as year 11 take two think about everything that you thought was different or you wished was different everything you weren't very happy with try and work out what you can do to make it better do you need to study in different place do you need to study in a different way um do you need to be more focused do you need to study for longer do you need to study for less time and you have the opportunity to take that and to change all of it for when we get to year 13. So you guys are in a really, really fantastic position because you get to correct your mistakes. All of the things that didn't go perfectly in year 11, well we can change them, we can make them go perfectly in year 13. So I really hope you took on board what I said last time about looking after yourself, um, that you know, 2018 being the year of you. Year 12 is such a fantastic year for discovering who you are, deciding what you want to do in the future, working out how, you know, you can change things in your life to make things better for you. And it's not selfish to want to change things to make things better for you. You have to look after yourself. So this is just kind of like a little video. We'll talk more when we're coming up to your end of year exams. Um, but this is, this is a really, really good time of year for you. This is a really, really good position to be in. I know, like, maybe starting things, things are starting to get a bit hard, things are starting to get a bit overwhelming, but think about how you would have reacted in year 11 and change it.